violence at that rally in Charlottesville had an impact on a local men's soccer team. Today's reporter Ethan Fitzgerald spoke with the Wright State University head coach about the impact. We tell tonight the team is back here in the Miami Valley and safe. Wright State University head coach Brian Davis tells me the team was looking forward to that match. Instead, the game was canceled after coaches were worried about putting their players at risk. You know, looking at what's going on today, it's a very, very smart decision to get out of there as quickly as possible. Wright State head soccer coach Brian Davis rallied his team after violence breaks out in Charlottesville. A canceled game and a seven-hour ride back home for the men's team. I went for a run around campus and, and went and saw for myself. In seeing it there with the police presence at about... 7.30 a.m. I mean, there's about 1,000 police officers in riot gear that early. Officials at both Wright State and the University of Virginia had a safety plan in place before deciding to cancel the game. And just staying as far away from it as we could and just, you know, monitor and, and keep our athletes isolated uh, as much as possible from things that could be harmful to them. As the players kept their distance, Coach Davis saw some of the violence firsthand. This isn't indicative of Charlottesville as a town, and so being around town, Everybody was really friendly. I mean, peop I think everybody was kind of in the same boat in terms of the locals were not happy about this protest being there. While the game was canceled, the Raiders took to their own field. Now they're back home. I didn't want their last memory of the day to be departing Charlottesville and, you know, state of emergencies on our phone. And I didn't want this day to be robbed of them of that. Now I asked the coach uh, if the game would be rescheduled, and Coach Davis tells me it does not appear that will happen. Ethan Fitzgerald, 2 News, working for you.